Dawson putting on the H God tag. I love it. So, one thing I was gonna, I think is gonna be interesting is that uh, when it comes to Falco Puff, Falco really has to play almost perfectly in a lot of interactions. Um, like risk reward is just heavily skewed in Puff's favor in a lot of things, but at the same time. Dawson's not a conventional puff. He's going to be going in. He's going to be trying to do cool stuff. So we'll see how it works out. Dawson's sick. Bari's sick too. So we'll see what happens. Uh, right now we're just uh, spamming the CPU. All right, so we're going to start here. Game one on Battlefield. Uh, Dawson in the corner, but... Bari has him in the air. Oh, up throw. Pound. Good job by Bari just rolling in, getting good positioning back. And if you're Falco here, this is really kind of the position you want to keep if you can. It's kind of hard to keep Puff in the air like that. And yeah, because he dropped it, he's in a bad spot now. But yeah, Falco can just sort of keep Puff in a position where she's within range of a laser or he can threaten Bear up air then that's what he wants. Even though we can't get like true combos, like he, he can at least like tack on some damage over time. Fair sends Wari off. Dawson read the side B in the center stage though. Bear not gonna do it. Good DI. Oh, nice tomahawk. And the back air shield poke is gonna do a clean up stock one. Dawson waiting out the invisibility on the ledge. Up throw? Uh, I think that was an up air. I don't think that was meant to be an up smash. Sorry, you going for the tech? Oh, I like that. That was really good. Because that covered everything except bolt in. And even then, Bari would have enough time to react to it. All right. Down air shine pressure from Falco. Dawson tried to read the drop down with an up smash. Could have gotten a juicy combo off of that. And that's really something he's really good at, just like scoping out and conditioning your defensive options to get you to do things that aren't necessarily smart in hindsight. Oh, I feel like he could have read the roll in there. Could have probably gotten something better than that. Double leaves are off legend to shine. Back here, not great the eye, but Puff's going to live that. Speaking of not good DI, but I don't think that was intentional. <laughs> Down smash. Oh, up smash. Crouch cancel, up smash. Uh, that can definitely kill our puff around 90 or 100. Good awareness there by Vari. Pound. Vari DI's it right. It's awesome. All the positioning, but that was a great air dodge from Vari, getting his footing back on stage, even getting a better position than Dawson, but right now, ooh, okay. Good shine out. Down air is not going to do anything, but it's going to keep Puff off stage. Dawson just kind of testing the waters with those like shallow nares in, seeing if he can maybe shield poke Vari, and he may just get a stock off of it. Air grab. Tried to read the roll in there, but Bari was able to slide off. I don't know about drill there because Falco definitely has some good options if the drill doesn't go right. He can just up tilt or up smash. Falling up air from Dawson. I like the back air to catch the jump there. And that's going to clean it up. That was good. So last stock here, but oh, Bari is not in a good spot. Especially at this percent. Can't really crouch cancel. Can't really afford to trade. Gets it back. Yeah, he's still in the air though. He doesn't. He wants to get on the ground, and yeah, that's it. All right, good stuff from Dawson. Cleaning up that edge guard. Uh, going to game two. Pretty sure. I don't think this is the best of five. So Dawson's gonna ban Yoshi's probably. Yeah. Oh, they're going to Yoshi's. Okay. All right, so the H God came out there game one for Dawson. Oh, waiting it out. Oh, oh, 
Oh, okay, okay, okay. Not how I thought that interaction was going to go, but uh, that was just good reactions there from Dawson. Uh, try to catch the falling downer with his own up air. Uh, it's 1-0 Dawson. Okay. Dawson gets back, his footing back, it's on the ground, but now it's back up in the air. Again, that's the kind of position where Falco wants Puff. It's still kind of tricky to punish her, but it's better than any other position, really, because most of the time Falco's not really going to get any true conversions, at this percent especially. Oh, good crouch cancel there from Bari. 69%. Falling backwards in air from Dawson. Back air has already off stage. Good short. The down smash sends up. All right. Oh, laser S smash. Um, not necessarily true, but it's a thing. It definitely happens. So, Bari evens up the stocks, but oh, Dawson's got him dancing right now. Got him on his toes. Oh, that could have been something. If you read Dawson's jump after the up air hit, he could have shined him and killed him off of that. Fourth throw, Vari's not going to die, but Dawson, okay. Turn him under, can't get the edge guard. Okay, back air cleans there up. Shine, okay. One thing I'm really noticing, oh, okay. <laughs> okay, good short, good short, you would have died otherwise, okay. Uh, one thing I'm really noticing from Vari is that Dawson is just doing a, a really good job of mixing up where he's landing. Oh! Okay, okay. We got tech chases. Uh, that, that was a good idea there from Vari. Oh, he doesn't have his jump. But yeah, that was a good idea from Vari. Uh, if you can get Puff to tech on those platforms, her tech rolls aren't very long, and uh, you don't have much ground to cover on the Yoshi's platforms. Okay, Nair Bear. Weird ounce attack on the F smash. Ah, oh, Dawson calls out the jump. That's going to be Vari's third stock. Oh, goes for another laser F smash. But again, that's not really true, but eh, it works sometimes. Back air. Oh, Dawson went for the falling up air. A Falco can shine out of that. Uh, yeah, up air's not going to kill yet. Dawson, let's dash back on stage, but uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, Falco wants Puff above him, but at the same time, like, it's really difficult to scope out the, what the Puff is doing trying to land if, like, they're as good as Dawson when it comes to, like, landing, uh, mixing up his landings. So, that's game two. Um, oh, alright, it's best of five. So, Dawson up 2-0. Going back to Yoshi's. Uh, yeah, Kirvari is really the only option you have. Uh, oh, bear up tilt. Scoping out the jump with his own back air. I like that, but let's see how Dawson responds to it. Oh, no. You don't want to jump there. You really don't want to jump there. Mm, can't confer off the up tilt. I feel like he was a little faster if you have gotten bear. I like the idea on the pound there because Dawson really hasn't been landing with pound very much. Uh, but it is one of the more punishable things Jigglypuff can land with. Oh, ooh. Okay, Vari holding good positioning here. Oh, crouch cancel off smash. And when you have that good positioning, that's what you can do. Uh, low percent, just hold down and uh, hope Puff hits you with something like a fair that you can crouch cancel and just get a juicy hit off of it. That's one thing I notice a lot about Dawson is that uh, at lower percents, he does tend to like swing a lot when it comes to like uh, fair and air and back air. And if you're a low enough percent, you can crouch cancel that. Uh, typically, though, he does a really good job of mixing it up. And now, just has him in a bad position. Soft fair is all you need, Twinkle Toes. Shine. Yeah. Can't really convert off of that. There. Ooh. Ah, you know. Yeah, Vari just kind of falling apart right now. Oh, bad DI on the down tilt, though. It's going to give him the stock. Yeah, you, mm, I, I don't really get what he was... Oh, okay, 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 okay. Making it cute to close out that set. Dawson wins 3-0.
So I believe Losers Finals is Churz versus Dawson. All right. Uh, of course, Churz losing to Kem in Winners Finals, 3-2. Uh, Kem making a surprise run from Long Island.